Midwest Athletic Conference to wrap up our show. Once again, it's show why many call it the best small schools conference in the country. Three teams playing for state titles with Coldwater and Fort Recovery winning gold in Columbus. Many years, Delphi St. John's in that title mix, but a young group with lots of injuries saw the Blue Jays win just one game last year, a fact they're hoping to put behind them. Coach wants us to put it in the back of our head, forget about it. Um, don't let it get to us. It's a very simple short-term goal for us, and it's to be better than we were the practice before. So uh, we've been able to do that, and we, we move forward every day. So we're excited, and you know, it's an exciting time of year when you get out and uh, start moving around out on the practice field again. Well, I'm excited. It's been a long, been a long time coming. Uh, I've been playing varsity now for like three years, and can't believe it's finally here. The Blue Jays believe that improvement began when that calendar flipped to 2016. We had a great offseason. Uh, um, you know, as, as a team, we do our individual meetings through the course of the winter, and kind of the resounding two things we needed to, to improve on was our, was our leadership and our overall team strength. And uh, I thought we had great leadership all winter long in, in the weight room and our offseason into the spring and summer workouts. And, uh, you know, our strength really improved over the year. And uh, so I'm excited about that, and hopefully that can translate into some good football. Just working hard in the weight room, being hard leaders everybody's working really hard uh, it's just been fun and those hard-working seniors have been catching the coach's eyes they were through the battles last year and most of them were in the midst of those games and you know th those are th those are tough situations to be in and, and to show back up on a Monday you know after you you had it put to you on a Friday night and uh, you know those guys kind of uh, uh, were, were we're leaders last year, but not so much in the sense where, you know, uh, this winter, as soon as we got back in the weight room, they, they made sure that everybody knew that uh, this is how it's going to be done and uh, just follow us. We'll, we'll take the lead. And, and they've handled that uh, through our summer camp as well and into our seven on seven. You know, in the midst of a seven on seven uh, competition, you know, when things aren't going well, I heard our seniors kind of pull the guys together and just be very positive. But yet, hey, this isn't the way we're going to get things done. So I'm excited to, to have that going already in, in, in the process. Even when we stepped on the first two a day, I knew. That, that wasn't going to be a problem. I wasn't going to have to say a whole lot about it. So, you know, I'm excited about that, and I, and I think that'll, that'll help us as well. I'm very excited. Uh, one and nine last year, tough year. We're going to come out and uh, be a better team.